I'm interested in saving the world. I want to save the world, and that's a big plan, but... <laughs> we have a serious problem on our hands, and it's a problem that needs to be solved. 2041 is the year that the treaty that preserves Antarctica could change, it could be stopped. We should have the sense to leave this place alone forever as a natural reserve, land for science and peace. I was reminded then in that moment of how powerful nature can be. There's so many people that know there's a problem, but I think there's so many people that also just assume that there's someone else working on it, right? Somebody else oh. is dealing with it. In order to tackle these human problems that really have a specific timeline on it, we have to tackle it together. People of my generation see climate change. The main question is what are they doing about it and are they prepared to make change for it? Antarctica is so important to all of us because we've been here. But it's also like an excuse for us, for the bigger picture, to show people that there's actually so much more to save. It's the entire Earth that we're talking about. Things have changed very, very quickly to being a mainstream issue that companies, governments, people are now taking seriously. The environment doesn't need us, it's us who need the environment. Everybody thinks that the world can't be changed now, that it's already too far polluted to, to become healthy again, and I don't believe that because it's not just me at stake anymore. It's not just my story, it's our story. And I fully intend to keep talking about it until I see and continue to see change.